session this session is on launch screen launch screen is also known as a splash screen and uh, launch screen instantly appear uh, when your apps starts up and uh, launch screen and splash screen is used to give an impression to an user that your app is fast and responsive it also enhance the perception uh, to your app uh, that it is ready for ready to use and uh, uh, as the after immediately immediately launch screen the first screen of your app get uh, gets appear or uh, launched and uh, we all know that different uh, different sizes of iPhone is available in the market and uh, and uh, for that uh, uh, so uh, for that launch screen uh, launch screen size will also vary and uh, to accommodate that uh, we have a storyboard in an Xcode uh, to set a static image for your device and uh, storyboard can also uh, be used to set your launch screen and it is very flexible and adaptable and uh, before designing a launch screen we should keep a few things in our mind that the design screen that the uh, that the design of a launch screen should be identical to your first screen of your app and uh, if, uh, if 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 the elements are different on the launch screen then the people may experience unpleasant um, uh, unpleasant flashes between the uh, launch screen and the first screen of your app and you also take care that there should not be a text on the launch screen because launch screen is an uh, static uh, uh, static image or a static screen so the text uh, written on, uh, on the launch screen won't be localized and launch screen should not be used as uh, as an advertisement uh, for your brand it it gives a bad impact uh, on the customer or uh, client which uses the app so don't include logos or any other branding elements so they are static part of your app of your now we will see uh, what all devices are available in the market and for that what size of launch screen do we need in portrait size and in uh, landscape size so Please have a look. For device 12.9 inches uh, in portrait and landscape, please have a look. We need uh, these uh, sizes for the portrait and landscape for these uh, devices. It is mentioned here. And please take care uh, while uh, designing your launch screen that they have the similar sizes as mentioned in the talk now we will see how we can set a launch screen to your app to do that go to Xcode create one new project launch screen demo created now this is our home screen we'll make this as a home screen so for that what we will do we will just uh, change the background color so that we we should be able to know that our home screen is different from the launch screen go to view now change the color to red and add a label here and write HOME home and make a color white so that it it could be it would be visible on the screen make it bold change its size okay and uh, aligned it to the center okay so this is our home screen now we will set our launch screen 
here you can see that uh, when we create a new project it automatically created a storyboard for your launch screen now we will add one image view and uh, we will stretch it all over the screen we will auto resize it so that it will have it should have it the same size of the screen now we will add one image here so we're going to use this image we dragged and dropped to the Xcode so this this will this image will be set on the launch screen so here it is this is to be our launch screen okay now we will going to run a uh, build and run our project you will notice that first our launch screen will get initiated and it appears and after that our first screen that is the home screen will get appear see this is the launch screen if it didn't uh, launch the launch screen then it will give a white screen and this is our home screen then so it uh, it's just uh, uh, creating uh, and a perception that uh, you need not to wait for a long so and uh, so it's creating perception that the the app is, is getting ready in in case uh, you can also do that you can start a loader so that uh, you want uh, uh, fill anything weird or uh, uncomfortable about that so thank you for watching this video and this is